Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Meghnath. In this module, we talk about four main pillars of object-oriented programming. Any developer or a tester or any student who wish to write some good code has to have a solid programming understanding of these concepts. So let's get started and let's see what are the four main pillars of object-oriented programming. Let's see this. Now, the first one is encapsulation. The second one is inheritance. The third one is polymorphism. And the fourth pillar is abstraction. So encapsulation, encapsulation, inheritance, polymorphism, and abstraction. These are the four main pillars of object-oriented programming. Now, we'll see which pillar talks about which concept in the next slide. Let's see this. Now, encapsulation talks about grouping of similar functionalities into a class. We talk about in detail in the next module of each and every pillar. So for now, encapsulation mainly focus on grouping of similar functionality into a class for security reasons, for modularity reasons, for reusability. So we group similar functionalities into a class that is encapsulation. Now, inheritance talks about sharing or reusing. So reusing of the already creating modules in, in child classes. So talk about inheritance. We're going to see inheritance also in detail later. And the next one is polymorphism. Polymorphism stands for redefining. We do it using method overloading or method overriding. So we talk about this as well in detail in the next modules. And last one is abstraction. So abstraction talks about data hiding from the external world. So the functionality that you have implemented in the class will not be known for the external world, but still they can use the functionality, but they will not be knowing what exactly is there inside. So this is the idea behind each pillar. So encapsulation talks about grouping and inheritance talks about sharing or reusing. Polymorphism talks about redefining and abstraction mainly talks about uh, data hiding. So in the next modules, we're going to talk in detail about each module. So. Thank you and see you in the next module.